In today's highly competitive textile industry, one New Zealand company has become synonymous with innovation and design excellence. One name has earned an enviable reputation for cost competitive garments and an aggressive national and international marketing stance. It's a name that has remained totally committed to its well established and stable manufacturing base and has backed it up with a solid investment in both people and plant with a major emphasis on new technology. It's a formidable leader in Australasia and an acknowledged contender in the major markets of the world. And best of all, it's a success story all its own. The name, Lane Walker Rudkin. A name that says it all. At a time when the garment industry's very future and existence was hanging by a thread, Lane Walker Rudkin took a bold decision, one that was to affect the very fabric of their operational infrastructure. It was a time when innovation would prove to be not only the pathway to the future, but the only course for survival. LWR looked overseas, looked long and hard at what was happening at the very heart of the international garment industry, looked at the trends, looked at the competition, looked at what consumers really wanted, but even had the foresight to look beyond that. Initially, a niche was identified in one of the fastest growing markets of the world, the leisure market. Hey, feel the spirit move and you are. Whatever you're doing, wherever you're from, while that fit feels so right, you just can't go wrong. In Canterbury, you Perhaps it's the success of the brand name of Canterbury that has indeed been one of the most significant factors which has firmly established Lane Walker Rudkin as the country's largest apparel manufacturer and most effective marketer. But this is just one facet of the company's sphere of operation. LWR means textiles, synthetic dye works, AKM and Argyle fabrics. LWR has become synonymous with some of the world's most famous brands, many of which are designer labels in their own right. A very diverse range. Hosiery. Casual wear. Children's wear. Lingerie. Swimwear. And underwear. See what I mean? More your size than mine, Ken. Proven brands such as Pickaberry, Blokes, Brax, Pierre Cardin, James Harper, Tikau, and Mertz. But the story doesn't end there, far from it. LWR is construction, property, freight, and computer services. Lane Walker Rudkin's expansive diversification and specialization has positioned it well to meet the challenges that tomorrow will inevitably bring. The company is involved in manufacturing the widest range of apparel products in the country. Continued success in the marketplace depends on technology, innovation, and of course, people. LWR's workforce of over 2,000 is a highly prized resource indeed. However, all these vital elements must be incorporated into an operation which is not only cost conscious, but highly cost competitive. That's the bottom line for true success, and that's where LWR excels.
A massive investment has provided the world-class technological base upon which the company can build an even more impressive and profitable performance and reputation. And it all starts back at the drawing board with the Denizen Optimizing System, a state-of-the-art computerized cut planner, and the Gerber AM5 grading and marker making system, which together have improved cloth utilization substantially. Linked to this system is the fully automatic Takuoka spreader, again computer controlled. The cloth is cut on a high-ply Gerber S91 cutter, which receives its instructions via magnetic tape from the AM5 and does the cutting automatically, boasting an equivalent output of seven hand cutters with absolute consistency, total accuracy, and maximum fabric utilization. The Baribi cutter also delivers what it promises. Impressive speed, too, sizing body panels perfectly with a resultant increase in output. Via a pre-programmed cutting system, this sophisticated die cutting machine ensures the most accurate cutting available in the world today. Electronic knitting machines also cut the time of style changes from three days to a mere two to three hours. They're programmed and patterned through electronic color screens and produce a myriad of designs. In fact, the options are virtually limitless. A quick, efficient response to a customer's order is the vital key to compete against imports. In the Canterbury Rugby Jersey factory, it used to take three weeks for this rugby jersey to be made and delivered to the warehouse. Today, it takes less than three hours on a rail system developed by the company. The process saves around 25% on overall manufacturing costs. That's another tangible testimony to LWR's commitment to the bottom line. Rail systems have also been individually designed for other factories and products to revolutionize workflow, reducing work in progress, cost of sewing, and giving a quick response to orders. From symbols to sleeves, tops to bottoms, pockets to pantyhose, efficiencies are really paying off. Take a look at George. This fully automatic pressing, folding and packaging machine has increased production by 40% alone. And for precise pressing and sizing of socks, the Takatori boarding machine is absolutely accurate, infallible. The textile group's technology has been upgraded substantially in Argyle fabrics, AKM and synthetic dye works. Color shades are computer matched and a stenter further enhances the quality and consistency of rugby jersey fabric. In fact, it's now come to be regarded as the worldwide standard, with LWR's performance ahead of the rest. Where there's an immediate advantage to be obtained, technology provides the answer. To this end, microprocessor controls and computers have now very much become the norm. In this one laboratory alone, the technological aids are all too apparent. But technology is merely a tool. It'll never replace human flair and individuality. Sven Anderson is such an individual. Hailed as the world's leading suit designer, he recently spent several weeks with the tailoring division and was only too willing to share his specialist expertise, which resulted in the new James Harper range. Above all, Lane Walker Rudkin is all about brands, and LWR brands are undoubtedly all about style.
Lane Walker Rudkin brands have enjoyed national and international recognition and unprecedented success. Much of this spearheaded by an aggressive marketing policy, including licensees and retail outlets in the UK, Sweden, Japan, Canada, the United States, Italy, and Australia. In fact, 64 retail franchise and company-owned stores around the world. It's quite astounding to see the enthusiastic reaction of our overseas visitors when they discover something as uniquely New Zealand as our Canterbury International range. Small wonder the product has gained such unparalleled acceptance in worldwide markets. Lane Walker Rudkin, a truly New Zealand company whose total commitment to the apparel industry has been amply demonstrated and a company that possesses all those attributes which have put our country well and truly on the map. Inspiration, innovation and determination Lane Walker Rudkin, the one name that says it all. <laughs>